Okay, now I'll show you about uh, exporting the files. You can do reports. Um, <clears throat> some of the reports are okay. These are a little bit uh, cluttered here. So, and we'll take some adjustments if we put them out into um, into Excel from there. So I like what I like using is uh, the estimating tab and you can go in here and you can make some adjustments like if you want to add uh, columns if you want to switch the columns around let's say instead of a uh, linear total let's let's say we want to put color I uh, don't need units for that so that'll that'll give us the color there we want to put in uh, say we want to put in a price here we go into the advanced and I know this is a little confusing it says uh, price each but it's actually going to be uh, cost each so let's say I want my labor here 70 cents that may vary in different parts of the country of course that'll give me for the square feet that'll give me my labor there put in cost each here for sheet rock maybe so then I can I can print this out into Excel and that will give me my list I have my prices, I have the colors these are coming out black because they're sub items of that takeoff there All right. So there's a few little tricks to help you out with Plan Swift. Things that I've learned that uh, help me generating my lists. Okay, thanks.